This is my first ever get ready with me, and I'm excited. I don't know how to do it, but we're gonna see. So basically, I don't know why, but over the past corona pandemic, I've been learning a lot of new things about myself. New likes, new dislikes, new types of people I want in my life, new people I don't want in my life. And it's just been a crazy ride. And I feel like because I'm trying to put everything that has to do with corona in my past, I was looking at my Instagram and my aesthetic and how I've been like dressing since like 2019, 2020. And I just... I don't like it. So I decided lately that I wanted to change my aesthetic and I'm here to bring you guys along for the journey. So the first thing that I did to kind of kick off this aesthetic change was go through a lot of my um, Instagram pictures and archive them. My Instagram had this 70s feel to it, very much 70s theme. All my pictures were like this super up contrast and super yellow orange tones but i decided i don't want that anymore so all the pictures that weren't that i went ahead and archived i will actually show you guys this was the aesthetic all of these colors here i love the streeter wear 70s aesthetic that i had but i feel like lately i've really been into this black dark tones bright blues neons rock like theme i don't know i haven't been listening to rock music or anything but that's just how i've been feeling so i changed it you know so after i did that i went and got my nails black and i even made a purchase let me go show y'all i went and bought these silver rings from amazon and like they're so cute to me and i even tried to change my tiktok a little bit and i actually have pictures i've been taking lately that i'm so excited to post to share with you guys and so many tiktoks I'm so excited to share with you guys. So we're just going to get into my get ready with me. I'm going to start off with my makeup and um, I've already established how I want it to look sort of. Um, and I don't want to wear makeup every day like I didn't before. But it's more of like an eyeliner, no lashes, just mascara, a little pop of color this time because I've never done that. So let me go get my makeup. Okay guys, I am so ready. I'm going to start by putting my hair up in a little ponytail because we're going to do my hair as well. So I'm just going to go ahead now by spooling my brows up and then I'm just going to fill them in. I don't really know how to describe this. It's like a natural but still glam. <laughs> Why I just flick it upward. <laughs> Now that my brows are done, I go in with my concealer. So once that's done, I'm gonna go ahead and put a little bit on my eyelid. Um, and I say a little bit because I want my eyes to be a bit lighter than my under eye. And sometimes I line my under eye, but I don't think I'm gonna do it today. We'll see how I feel. You know, we're just gonna do it. So usually you line your under eye with a concealer, but I like to have um, this powder that I use is Prime and Stay Finishing Powder. Okay, so there's that side. We're going to do the other side. After I line my brows, they usually look like this. So then I just take one of my smaller brushes and kind of try to buff it out without making it go away. Because this is setting powder, so it does set into the skin. And now those are the brows. Now I move on to my eyes. I'm going to also just put that powder all over my eye. Once that's packed on, it's time to do the eyeliner. So I use my Jaclyn Hill palette and I use the black shade, which is called Abyss. And I just tap into that on this thin elf brush um, and I just kind of create this eyeliner where I hold my eyes straight and I bring it in all the way in a straight line. So as I take it, I go on top, I just mess it up. Now for the bottom, I just take it and do the same. Also connect the bottom with the top one. I take my finger, I close my eye, and I just rub my finger all over it. This is the smudging part that's very, very important. All right, now I want to add a little bit of pop of color. So I'm going to take this uh, blue-green color, which is called Pool Party, right here. I'm just going to tap into that and kind of add it towards the bottom. Now that that's done, it's time to do mascara, which is like one of my last steps. So I just go ahead and add that to my top and bottom lashes. Really make sure you get the bottom lashes. Comment down below you guys' favorite 
TikTok trend right now. Right now it's the backyard again. And I'm loving how everybody is finally appreciating how great their soundtrack is. Like, they really did that. Just gonna add some of this powder on my under eye. And now I'm just going to bronze my face. I love bronzer more than I love contour, honestly. Because it literally like, it's so subtle. Now I'm gonna add highlight and I will come back when it's time to do my hair. I do my lips and I use like a brown eyeshadow or a brown eyeliner. And one thing about the aesthetic that I love is getting rid of my cupid's bow. I love my cupid's bow, but when I connect it with the other side, it makes my lips look so much fuller. I really like my hair like this, so I'm going to keep it, but the edges do need to be refreshed. So I'm just going to fix it up better. I'm probably throwing a hat today because I really like how a hat looks. So y'all see how my edges look now. They're really curly because they were wet because I just showered. Yeah, we're going to throw on a hat today. Now it's time for me to put on my outfit. Well guys, that was my get ready with me for my new grunge aesthetic. If you want to check out my new grunge pictures, they're on my Instagram at CRXandrea. I'm so excited to start this new uh, journey with you guys. I look so lame. If you guys have any suggestions of websites or any places where I should get my clothes from, let me know. I am going thrifting soon. White Springs, Florida. Hello. <laughs> thank you guys for watching enjoy this video give it a big old thumbs up make sure to subscribe to my channel and become a king or a queen also check out my previous video follow me on tiktok at crx andrea if you want to see my tiktoks i love you guys so much and i'll see you guys in my next video bye